Hey, um, hello everyone. Uh, I come back to this uh, topic of the conditional format. Um, it, uh, my friends is asking uh, how can we highlight the um, minimum or the maximum value of each row or column. So in this video, I will share with you how to do that. It is quite easy. Um, so in my screen here, you know, I have, uh, of course, when I look into the, the row, I have the, um, on February, uh, they have the 5,369 uh, in the sales, we see the lowest one, and the maximum, of course, will be the 28,000, right? okay, and uh, in, in case uh, you uh, um, like to uh, Uh, minimize this one. Yeah. Um, right. Um, in case I want to uh, look into the column in here, you know, easy. I can put the uh, um, table calculation to the table down, so they will look uh, into every uh, every column. Uh, we see the minimum level and what is the maximum level. Okay, so I will show you how to do this one. So I will start from the beginning. So uh, I will print the um, the product category in. Also, I print the order date in as well. Uh, let me move this one to the month. Okay, and I print the sales into the view. Right? So sell it okay so I have it um, uh, in the view here on the cell so I want to look into the um, minimum and maxi maximum level uh, value of each column or it, you know, it, it, it row right so basically they use the same formula so I created the uh, calculated field they call that the maximum or minimum highlight so I use the table calculation, so I say if the sum of sales equal to the window max sum of sales, then I, I say that max. Uh, and uh, similar, if the sum of sales so, um, uh, equal to the window minimum, uh, you know, or the sum of sales, then I put it min, or you know, in the, in otherwise I put it in, uh, between. So you may um, note how the window max or window min will work right so at least uh, uh, the formula will look into the table uh, by row or by column it it, it uh, will up to uh, your setting right and then they find the maximum or minimum level and uh, um, and they compare right? okay and then i will print this one into the color so i change the color now so I put the minimum is uh, okay red already there, maximum is green there, yeah. and then the one in between I put uh, maybe in the blue. Okay, so I have it here. Yeah, this one is uh, when I look into the the row, you see the minimum number, the minimum value, and the maximum value here. So if I want to change, I want to. Um, to find the, I want to highlight the minimum value and the maximum value by column. So in here, I just go to the uh, using of the table down. Right? And now you have that minimum and the maximum, right? Okay, um, it's simple, right? Okay, so this is this is how you highlight the uh, minimum and the, and the maximum value. Uh, um, by tax right but if you want to go to the uh, one step further we see um, you want to highlight the background uh, of the sale rather sales uh, other than the tax right so if you recall my previous section you know it uh, just do it very simple um, I create the calculated field just a dummy one so I put value to one here just a dummy one whatever value you want to put it in and then you print this one into the uh, size right? um, and then you uh, 
uh, you you change that to the bar, right? and you put the maximum. Yeah. And out, um, okay. So in the screen now, you can see, you know, it it uh, easier uh, and then the minimum value and the maximum value. Uh, when you format, the, when you change the color, when you format the color on the background, it will be more reflected, right? Uh, so easier to to monitor to see. Um, so and then to, in in the next few steps, you just do the formatting, you know, in order to uh, to change the color and the size, the styles, and uh, you change the, um, the the visualization name of the sheet, right? And now you back to uh, you will go to the you will get to uh, the result I have in here. So I think one more thing is on the tooltip. So I think it's I uh, just remove this one. Um, so we have the uh, sum of sale and then uh, you have the maximum win. Okay, and here you have the February the subcategories is the art and and you have the sales in it. And then the um, the color, I think you can remove it as well. Yeah. So now it's easy. So uh, let's try it uh, by uh, the cross we see by the row. Okay, yeah, you can see the two tip it changed as well. Sub subcategory is accessories, and then you you uh, you have here the minimum values and the maximum value. Okay. So um, I hope uh, you find it useful and uh, have a great day. Bye-bye.